Hey, do you live in Portland? And are you even thinking about buying a home or know somebody who is? Well, if, you, if so, this video and this YouTube channel are perfect for you. Hi, I'm Alex Roy with John L. Scott. I'm Anthony Loaders with Priority Home Lending. And you're watching Lenders Corner. It's our opportunity to ask a real life lender some questions from some real life viewers like yourself. And today's topic is all about this big guy right here, the down payment. And trends like, you get questions like this all the time, don't you? Absolutely, almost daily. <laughs> well, the first one comes from Gary up in the Hollywood district. And Gary asks, what are the common minimum down payments? You know, Gary must be aware there's different things going on. You could have different down payment types. Yeah, yeah. depends on the type of program you do. But uh, in a conventional scenario, we can go down to as little as 3%. Wow. FHA, 3.5%. And then we do have some no down options. Uh, depending on the borrower in the scenario, VA, if they're a veteran or, or currently active, they do have access to no down. And then property dependent, USDA, mm. uh, more of a rural property, the property must be eligible, fits a little tighter box, but that's a no down option as well. But of course, you know, that's only for some people yes. uh, and some property situations. So yes. not yes. everyone can get that zero down payment situation. Yeah, not everybody applies, but for those that do, it's a great option. There you go. And so that leads right into our second question from Tim in Woodstock. He asks, what if we're really tight on cash? So they, they cannot do the zero down option, but they need cash. What can we do? We've got a couple options. You could get a gift from a family member. So his okay. dad could gift him some money. Um, if they have the down payment, but maybe we're a little tight on assets for closing costs, we could take a little higher interest rate and get that money credited back to us. It can't go in your pocket, but it can go towards closing costs. Oh, okay. Very cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then the last thing they could do, and, and this is something we could work on together, maybe come in higher than, than the asking offer um, and then offset the, the difference of that and, and closing cost credit from the seller. So if we had like a house that was 300,000 list price, yes. they need 3,000 cash, they make the offer for 303,000 with a seller credit of 3,000 yep, back to the buyer's closing costs. Yep, seller still nets the same, helps yep. the buyer get the deal done. So I see win. this all the time on the listing end, the seller's take kindly to it, it's not a problem. And uh, as buyers, I write this into the offers, it's a good strategy. Yeah, yeah, it's a win-win for everybody. Right on, and our final question. Uh, this one's from Trent in Milwaukee. Um, how does the down payment affect the offer? Alex, I'll serve this one up for you. Well, you know, representing sellers out there, I can say that there are some sellers that look at a higher down payment as being a stronger offer. It, it gives them the feeling that these uh, folks are more, um, they're financially stronger mm -hmm. and they're more committed to it because they're putting more cash down. Now that might not be true, but there is a bit of perception with it. And so I do think it's best to bring the strongest amount of earnest money and the strongest amount of down payment to your offer. It helps you compete in this tough market out there. Gives the seller ease of mind, doesn't it? It does. It does yeah. ease their mind that if we get into situations in the transaction where a little bit of cash needs to come forward because of the appraisal, mm -hmm. we feel more comfortable that there's that buffer room there. Absolutely. Yeah. Hey, well, this has been a fantastic discussion. So much more we could talk about, Thank but you. that's why there's going to be another one next month. So tune in again. Uh, I'm Alex Roy. I'm Anthony Loaders. And we're here with uh, Priority Home Lending and John L. Scott. Give us a call anytime to ask our questions. Look at all our uh, information down in the description and like and share this video. Thanks so much, guys. See you next month.